Five Nights Nature documentary about dinosaur and prehistoric animals premiere on Apple TV Plus was so incredible. Previously, I did each five episodes review and this video as the final review and conclusion from all of them. Hi, how's it? My name is Black Surfall and here is my final review. So the first thing I like to appreciate is the cast. Prehistoric Planet produced by John Favreau. He's also produced The Lion King and The Jungle Book with amazing photorealistic development and so Prehistoric Planet also developed with photorealistic visual effects as their final results are so detailed. From the animals, atmospheres, and biomes are feel so real. It feels like we are traveled back to their era and encounter with them in their life. This documentary also narrated by popular nature narrator Sir David Attenborough, the only person who I like on nature documentary commentary. Not forget to mention, I also, I also love the soundtrack so much, composed by Hans Zimmer. I love his soundtracks in many movies. The making of the animal designs and behaviors are under the lead consultant, paleozoologist Darren Nace and the other paleontologists. They described how the animals supposed to be look like and their behaviors. Now let's talk about the dinosaurs and other prehistoric animals. The way they designed them are very accurate and mind-blowing. Though maybe some are not in my expectation, but I'm very impressed by the way they look like. Through a long debate and some still in, but it really gave us the real image of extinct species. The popular Tyrannosaurus rex was designed so robust and the babies had feathers and all the theropods designed to have lips so we didn't see their teeth out when they closed their mouth unlike crocodiles. Feathered dinosaurs like Velociraptor, Nanosaurus, Dinochirus and more are amazing. I love those feathers, um, they look super detailed. The variety of coloration matches with their surroundings and some are referring to modern animals such as the Mononychus, it was referring to barn owl. The unknown parts of the animals were explained, that is, was not completely useless. I like Carnotaurus small arms. Um, it was thought it useless, but by studies on modern animals, it can be concluded that anything that might be look useless are not really useless. The behavior of the animals also variated. Some are cute, caring, and cruel. There are a lot of new dinosaurs and non-dinosaurs we haven't heard before, so it will expand our knowledge about them. But not few often only mention their genus, so it's giving us a curious what are they named or we can guess them. I also spot some of the animals, especially the pterosaurs, maybe are not supposed to be live in the same continent with other species based on their fossil discovery. Well, let's give a big question that need to be think about. The natural instincts are made based on modern animals. They know and adapted to hunt and to catch their food to survive the weathers and predators know when and where a good place to nesting and more. The players are taking in different biomes. There was taking in the ocean coasts, deserts, volcanic areas, swamps, forests, rivers, and ice worlds. All of them are so great with the dangerous calamities so the dinosaurs must survive it. The majestic things that was made it so beautiful like enchanted world is the glowing things in the dark cave, glowing fungus and bioluminescence ammonites. I like the transition from place to place, so it was very enjoyable to watch rather being focused on one place from the 
beginning to end. The story writing is so great, the some ending are a little not very good, but overall is amazing. I love all the dinosaurs and other species. I love how realistic it is and the accurate designs. The storylines are enjoyable. There are a little comedy in it. Cute moments and cruel story, but it was awesome. If I had to rate each episode, so the first episode got 8.7, the second episode got 9, third episode got 7.6, fourth episode got 9.5, and the last episode got 10 ratings. So that's mean episode 5 is my favorite episode. Overall, it's 10 out of 10 ratings. That was an outstanding documentary series. I hope there will be more Thanosaurus documentary like this. It was really enjoyable, education, uh, educational, and mind-blowing documentary to watch. I highly recommend to watch this and not disappointing. If you like to talk about the accurate of the species in prehistoric planet and their facts, give this video 100 likes and I will mo more videos of them. Alright, so if you really enjoy this videos, and if you are new to my channel, please subscribe so you won't miss any videos I make, and give it a like, and I will see you next time. Auf Wiedersehen.